What's up guys, today I'm just going to be doing a quick overview of the FMA uh, mobile phone carrier. Um, I'm going to show you how I modded it to fit um, with the plate carriers that I use, and then just give a quick overview of what I think of it and uh, my use of it. I got this carrier from Spec Warfare Airsoft for about 20 bucks. Um, I've got it, I bought it to use with my LBX Armatus 2 and my Ferro Concept Slickster that I have sitting here. Now, uh, one thing about both those plate carriers is they just have Velcro up on top. And this phone carrier is actually meant to be used with Molly. So I'll real quick go over how I modded the phone carrier to work with my carriers. So if looking at the back of the phone carrier here, you can pretty clearly see what I did. First of all, I cut off the tabs here, 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 and here that would normally go into the Molly slots. Um, I then just took adhesive backed Velcro, put it on the back of the carrier, and this has actually worked surprisingly well for me. I'll show you um, how I mount it here. So as you can see, I just flipped it around and stuck it right on that Velcro. Initially, I was a little worried about how well that would actually stay in place, but after running at um, Operation Bone Strike at Camp Shelby this last weekend, um, it worked great. The Velcro held very well, Never came loose whatsoever, even though I banged it around quite a bit, um, so I've been very happy with it. Um, right off the bat, one of the first things I didn't care for about this case was the pull tab here. Um, I had to do a double knot on it just because it was so loose that um, the phone carry could flap open when you were running around. Um, but after putting a knot in that to tighten it up, uh, it worked really well throughout the weekend. Um, as you can see, I threw an IR flag on the outside, um, the patch that's on, or the Velcro that's on the carrier itself um, is a little small for a standard size patch, but it doesn't really matter that much. Also, as you can see here, they do have a cutout for your phone camera. So I suppose if you really wanted to, you could um, record gameplay or whatever with your phone as you do it. Um, so let's open this up. As you can see here, it's just a pull tab with some bungee cord um, that secures it right there. So you just pop that up and then the phone carrier will flip right down. Now as you can see on the Slickster, it does hit your mags um, when you open it up. So that is a bit of an issue. It does not do that on the Armatus. Um, it'll just be kind of a carrier by carrier thing for that. You can see here now we're looking at a side view of this phone carrier. Now uh, as you can see here, I'm just gonna take my iPhone 5 and lay it right in there. And then this uh, clips right down over it, holds it nice and secure. Um, there is a plastic insert that goes into the, to cover your um, camera screen as well. So that's pretty nifty that they include that. As you can see here, um, it's pretty easy once you flip down to access whatever you're working on. Um, mostly what I use is my photos for maps, Intel, uh, different things like that. Um, but yeah, so it's a pretty slick little setup. Uh, I, like I said, I used it last weekend at Operation Trench Knife by Third Coast Airsoft at Camp Shelby in Mississippi. And uh, it was actually very helpful not to have a bunch of different maps printed off. Just saved everything I wanted, um, threw it on the phone, and I was good to go. Um, as far as I know, they only make up to an iPhone 6 compatible case right now. But uh, I would have to assume that they will be making more in the future. So you guys have it. That's just a quick little overview of the case. Um, there's not a lot to it, um, but it is a it's good, a decent system, I believe. Um, it's fairly sturdy. This hinge here seems to be fairly well built. Um, so yeah, overall, I would recommend it. It's very handy to have, especially if you do a lot of admin type stuff on the field or you have a lot of different maps and you don't want to be digging through your pockets to find the right one all the time. So yeah, if you guys could give me a like and subscribe, um, let me know if you want to see any more info on it, any other details, and I'll see you guys on the field.